What's going on, y'all? Jay Ryder here, and today, the action video. So, August Alcina made a song about entanglements. Oh, man. <laughs> I literally just woke up an hour ago and went on Facebook. I just seen it all through my timeline. I'm like, what the, man? Boy, petty. <laughs> all right, but before we get to it, um, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Um, leave a like on the video. It'll help me a lot. And yeah, um, if you haven't already, um, turn that notify bell on so you can get the videos when I upload them. Man, but all right, let's 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 get into it, man. Crazy, crazy. If everything. Ooh, let's go. Special moment in history. Yeah. No, <laughs> really don't tell me the relationship. But you still fucking with me. Yeah, I'm taking a bitch. There's no need to get on this. Let's go back real quick. Definition of entanglement. When you tangled in the sheets. Girl, I know that we don't call it a relationship, but you still fucking with me. Oh, man. This track. Is this a diss track? I can't believe he did this, man. I wasn't ex expecting this. Ooh, what do y'all think? Is this a diss track? It seemed like <laughs> Man. Ooh, let's, let's keep going. Hold on. Hold on. Let me go back real quick. Started leaning on my shoulder, got her questioning my willpower. Willpower. Jaded by her beauty, but her reputation real solid. Willpower. Jaded. Will. Jada. Hey, Rick Ross. You getting in the mix too, man. I oh, don't know. That is one thing you make a song about, like, somebody. That's another thing you actually let somebody feature on it. You about to be entanglement with the entanglement. <laughs> but, hey, this song, this song kind of bumped right now. Let's keep going. Not to be with a broken heart. Still, I got to get around. Favorite artist was too far. Watch a movie, then we freaking take it up. I'm getting deal. Entanglement is when the middle. Go back, man. I gotta, I gotta go back one part. Still, I gotta get around. Favorite artist was Tupac. And you know he talking about Jada. Because, you know, Jada had, you know, a real close relationship to Tupac. We don't know if they was, like, together. But you know they was, like, really close friends. But, man. Man. Crazy, man. It's crazy. Can't believe, <laughs> can't believe he actually made this song, especially with Rick Ross. Like, what Rick Ross got to do with anything? Let's keep going. Got it crumble. Saddest part is I still love you just to keep it simple. Don't want no strings attached. Okay. Hey, man, Rick Ross killed that part, though, man. Boy, had a nice flow. I like it. I like it. I just want to comment on that. I just want a nigga that's gonna break your back in half. No, I ain't about to play with that. I left you, man, to fuck with me just to pay him back. Don't you know that's cold hearted? What you gonna do, man? Whoa, okay. Bump. Bump that. He dissing. He dissing. He dissing. Let's go back to the lyrics. Go back. Um. It was just like, basically. You want you wanted somebody to break your back, and remember Jada was saying that she ain't feel good in a long time. Boy, if you won't get your man, ooh, and she, oh man, he even said you left your man to fuck me just to pay him back. What you doing, August? What you doing, man? 
Oh my, what is this man doing right now? What is this man doing right now? Is he really that hurt? Don't you know that's cold hearted once you're gone, no coming back. Girl, you be fucking with a young and I don't be doing shit you like. I don't know why I read that part, but man. This this boy crazy. Man, he's just he's just talking shit. Basically. Man, let's let's get back into it. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Okay, okay, the <laughs> bad part is, man, the song is not bad. I actually like the song. It's a bump. Like, uh, this is, I probably, I'm probably listening to this song, like, a couple more times. I'm probably playing it in the car. I just, it, <laughs> it just sucks how, like, the meaning behind it because of the whole drama with all of them. Uh, man, what y'all think, man? Is he petty for uh, doing this song? I feel like he is. I feel like... You you basically started this whole thing. You know, nobody would have known if you never said anything about it. You know what I'm saying? Y'all could have been living y'all little lives. You know what I'm saying? But, um, and it's crazy how he said it during his new album. I feel like he was just trying to get his album more, you know, that little oomph, you know, because he about to be trending now because of the whole drama thing. Especially he made this song and it's just like, oh, you about to be, okay, you about to be talk of the people for another couple of weeks, you know what I'm saying? Or another week. <laughs> people move on fast. So, you know, you got to keep people entertained, you know? So I don't know if that's his thing about it or he really butthurt because on Twitter he was all butthurt about it and everybody was just like, hey, you don't want started this. It's true. I don't know, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to pull up when he there. He always take me and you fucking If yeah. you see me, he going to trust me low key. Oh, okay. We got to go back on this one. Okay. Man, he talking. It, his ish right here, man. I'm not, I don't even want to. Y'all know. He said that ain't my girl, but I got the key to the crib and to a high. To the crib into a high. She don't want to label shit, but she needs me in her life. I don't have to label shit to fit in her life. Damn, man. It's like, I feel like, man, he disrespectful, man. <laughs> but I mean... Man. Like, it's, it's Jada's fault, too, man. Man, I feel... I, I, do y'all think they really gonna stay together? Cause even even in the end, August still kind of lost because he he's not with Jada. Will still with Jada, as far as we know. I mean, it's like a I feel like it's a a W and an L for a Will. Still got your wife, but at the same time, you got that baggage now because of what she did. You know. Oh, petty man, you petty August. But I mess with the song. I mess with the song. Ain't no circuit no more. That's crazy. And the song bump. That's another thing. It was a song is his ass, but the song actually is um pretty good. So it's actually it's good. I mean Oh wow man. I can't believe it. he dissing. Dissing. Man, that's crazy dog. I just feel like he petty petty for all of this. What y'all think, man? Y'all think he petty? Let me know, man. Let me know in the comments. Let me know what you think about the whole situation. 
And do you think he really butthurt about it, the whole um, situation? Or was this a thing for to get more album sales? You know, because he said it when his album dropped. So it was just like one of those things like he, he, he did it for the clout get more you know what i'm saying sales and make him trending you know what y'all think man let me know i think he's petty because yes but i guess you know every everything gotta come to light right so i guess you know but i mean the the thing is that i guess will already knew so like you know you petty for like telling everybody you know let me know man let me know all right uh so if you like the video um please give the video a like it'll help me out if you're new please subscribe to the channel you know um turn that notify bell on so when i upload y'all can receive it you know, real quick um yeah all right y'all have a good night good afternoon whenever you're watching this video and yeah